Ah, geek, geek out. Pinky's up. It's time for another geek out book club. <laughs> I'm Sam. I'm Jake. Uh, this week we're going to be talking about uh, Weird Detective number one, which is a new mini series by Dark Horse Comics. Uh, written by Fred Van Lente. He's done a lot of work with uh, Hercules and the Incredible Hulk over from Marvel. Um, he's, and he's been doing quite a bit of work with with, uh, with Dark Horse lately. The uh, art is by uh, Ju Villanova. So, uh, yeah, it's kind of... Uh, the first issue will be out Wednesday, June 15th. Um, yeah, Jake, what would you think of the book? Um, I love a good title for a book. And Weird Detective is one of those ones that, like, I don't know, I just... Like, spot on. Yeah, it's just like, oh, it is spot on. Because <laughs> when, I, when I say this, I mean it in the best way possible. It's fucking weird. And, like, I and I, and I dig that, you know? And, and the book, I, I think one of its strong suits in, that, in, in this first issue is it doesn't hide from that. It, it wears that like a fucking badge of honor uh, for its weirdness. Yeah, no, it's, it's awesome. I mean, it's, there's definitely kind of a pulpy... Yeah. Pulpy feel to it. Uh, I mean, the main character, without giving too much away, he's got like all these old 1940s uh, detective film movie posters around his That's apartment. That's really cool. Yeah. He's always watching detective fiction. That was really cool too. Yeah. All the different detectives. Anything that detectives. anything that references Jim Rockford, mm-hmm. the Rockford Files, will, will kind of get the the seal of approval uh, for me. Uh, this is also it's an oversized first issue. So yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah it is. it's it's like forty eight pages. So definitely you're getting a bang for your buck this yeah. time around. Um, yeah, the I guess the basic premise is you've got this detective of mysterious origin, a weird detective in fact, <laughs> um, that has well more than our mere five senses. Yeah, that's cool. And uh, you see them all to full effect in this issue, and uh, of course, murder mysteries and that sort of hijinks and and buddy cop. It's a pretty gruesome shit too in there. Yeah, yeah, this one ain't for the kitties. No, it's not. Um, but yeah, no, man, it's it's a really good kind of. I think you were saying off mic, it kind of reminded you of kind of Constantine level because he's always kind of solving well, mysteries it, it, himself. The the just the look of the the main character, the weird detective, <laughs> um, is very like early John Constantine. Like the like the you know he's not the tie's not loose and whatever. Like he's very like the when he looked like well, Sting. Honestly, he kind of looks like. Um, not not with the hair, but with yeah. his uh, like scarf and overcoat, he kind of looks like Cumberbatch's Sherlock. Yeah, that's true. I mean, um, that, that that would work perfectly yeah. too. And that kind of cold, moral nature, aloofness kind of lends itself there too. Yeah. So yeah, there's a lot. If you're a big fan of kind of, there's obviously a lot of supernatural, a lot of paranormal stuff going on with this. If you're a fan of good, a good cracking noir yarn, mm-hmm. then hey man, definitely give this one a go. Again, out in comic shops and on Comicsology everywhere. On Wednesday, June fifteenth, definitely check it out. Supersized issue, so you know, plenty, of, plenty of stuff to work with. That's right. So yeah, it's been another, uh, it's been another geek out book club. I'm Sam. I'm Jake. So keep reading. This has been another geek out production. If you enjoyed what you heard, hey, you know, we've got a new commentary every Monday. We've got a special episode every Friday. Of course, there's the usual catching up show every Wednesday, and you get book club episodes just about every Tuesday these days. Thanks for listening.